Hi, my name is Ann Bryant, Executive Director of the National School Boards Association. Along with America Online, we are proud to present this video introduction to online safety. As you know, the Internet has made its way into millions of American homes and schools. Our kids are growing up online, learning more than ever online, and our students are becoming smarter online. And just as we've all learned how to act safely and responsibly in the real world, we need to be alert and informed in cyberspace. Until the rules of online safety are as recognizable as the flashing don't walk signs, these tips will help us surf a little safer. There is a wonderful world of opportunities on the web, like being part of a virtual classroom 24 hours a day, and we want to make the most of it. But we need to make sure we all know the rules of the road out there in cyberspace. So cue up the video, grab your keyboard, and get ready for safe surfing. Thank you. Save Surfing, starring Taryn Smith from Home Improvement, Jenna Lee Green from Sabrina the Teenage Witch, Kerry Strug, Olympic gold medalist, Irene Ung from The Mystery Files of Shelby Woo, and Eddie Jones of the Los Angeles Lakers. Hi, I'm Taryn Smith from Home Improvement. Why did you paint your nails black? Why did you paint yours pink? <laughs> if you guys are like me, you like surfing the internet to see what's up. You can check out your favorite music, cool websites, even do your homework. Of course, when you get older, you probably don't go online every day for work and fun. So why not learn the best way to cruise the internet? Did you know that you got to be careful what you do and where you go out there in cyberspace? Well. A bunch of my friends rounded up some tips to show you how to stay on your board and surf safely. Now, here's a tip from me. Say you go to a music website. I like to get song lyrics, download music videos. I even trade guitar tips with my friends. That's all I trade, though. Save surfing! Never give out your password to anyone, not even your best friend. Don't even tell someone who might look or sound official. I mean, that's like giving a complete stranger a key to your house. Jenny Green. Okay, so I'm not really Libby from Sabrina the Teenage Witch. It's just a character that I play. Oh, look, it's Sabrina's band. <laughs> In real life, we're totally different. Oh well, not totally different. We both love clothes. Oh, that's a cute top. You've got mail. Betsy6708? I have no idea who that is. Better delete it. Say something. You should never accept files, website addresses, or email from people that you don't know. There are a lot of nasty things traveling around on the internet that could damage your computer or even steal your password. You've got to be careful what you download. <sighs> Just what I wanted. See? You've got to know where to go and what to stay clear of.
culture or other nearby adult about any threatening or bad language you see online. If something makes you uncomfortable, just remember that you're in charge. of Shelby Wu. That's it. You know, Shelby's not the only one who likes digging around for facts and information. In real life, I go online all the time to explore ideas about my other love, the field of medicine. There's so many fascinating sites and people to share ideas with. It makes my DNA dance. There are a few things, though, that I don't share with anyone. Save serpent. Never give out personal information about yourself to someone on a chat line or bulletin board. Like your name, address, phone number, picture, or where you go to school. Making online friends can be cool. Just be sure your parents know who you're chatting with. And you don't have to be a detective to know that sharing personal information online is a bad idea. Uh, sorry, Irene. I'm ready for your close-up. Jones of the Los Angeles Lakers. I thought I'd take the time out, check out the scores, and check in with my fans. I met some good friends online, but there are all kinds of people out there. And remember, you have to be your own defensive guard. Save sir. Never say you meet someone in person without first asking your parent, teacher, or some other responsible adult. There's millions of people out there in cyberspace. You can't be really sure of who you're chatting with. Keep your guard up, and you'll always come out on top. Hey, what were those tips again? Never give out your password or other personal information to anyone online. Don't accept files, website addresses, or email from strangers. If you encounter bad language or anything threatening online, Leave the chat room or log off, and then tell a parent or teacher. And never say you'll meet someone in person without first getting permission from your parent or teacher. For more information, log on to our website at www.safesurfing.com. Hey, it's me, Taryn, again. That was some pretty good advice, huh? I mean... Most people out there in cyberspace are just like you and me, but you should still surf safely. Hope you keep it in mind next time you go online. See you in cyberspace. <laughs>